So I was just looking through some old videos and saw some clips that I hadn't posted before. Uh, it was our visit last year, the Turkey Rod Run, Daytona Beach, uh, Daytona International Speedway. So uh, it's just a walk around. It's if you've never been there, it'd be interesting just to maybe see what it looks, what it's like there. Uh, lots of folks, lots of stuff to see, lots of parts to buy and sell, and uh, some beautiful cars to to in the show there too. Uh, anyways, here it is. I hope you get a kick out of it. Why it won't That's a Speedway Grandstands right over there, huh? Lots of cars trying to get in this morning. All right, we're here at the 24 Turkey Rod Run. We're here with Michael. Michael is a celebrity. He's one of he, he's one of the guys that sells uh, uh, on the swap meet. But how many years you been here? Uh, about 18. 18 years. Yeah. And so you just got done telling me how much the spaces cost to. Six hundred and thirty dollars for these spaces. The one right on the asphalt costs you one sixty by itself. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. But uh, and we got some crummy weather. Let's just take a look down. The, not very good weather today. We're kind of covered up out here today because I mean, we're about the time we uncover it, it rains a little, and then we cover it back up, and it stops raining. So we've been fighting it all day, but it's well, still worth being here. But it's only uh, today's Friday, right? Friday, yeah. So this, you're going to be here this today, is the best day, tomorrow, and yeah. tomorrow. Yeah, we'll be here Saturday and Sunday too. But as you look down through there, you can tell it's quite a crowd out here. Yeah, yeah. It's, the best day. it's uh, there's a lot of folks out there, that's for sure. So, yeah, if we just parked. We were in line in the parking uh, to so get parking and, <laughs> and park us or yeah. whatever you call it. rain, rain jackets. Well, hey, have yourself a good day. I hope, hope the weather clears up. That. I'm freezing my butt off out here, but <laughs> thanks for talking to me. Yeah, no problem. All right, have Stop. a good one. I remember the Manners big boys. Frisch's, Elias Brothers. Fifty bucks. Where the nitrous, the nitrous kit and stuff that you were looking back there, Chevrolet's are assessing to take. Yeah. We had a set of 7.99 heads sitting there. How much were those? They have prices. It's a roaster, though. Huh? Uh, I talked to him last year and he said he didn't have anything that old. Should I check with him again or no? Lots of activity here. How's Oil Express doing today? Ah, oh, we're doing great. All right. Hey, how much was the, oh, the gas pump? I like it. 22 cents a gallon. I'll take that shit. <laughs> Have a good one. So here's one I always liked. 56 Chevy sedan delivery. 12.5. Needs a little work, but it's really solid. Really solid. And then here is 67 uh, GTO, which is one that I uh, I really liked. Beautiful car. This one's in really good shape. Take a look inside. They're very nice inside. How about you giving me money? Check out the check out under the hood. It's beautiful. Very pristine. 67.
Is that a low rider? <laughs> uh, crazy. Rain is here. It's getting muddy. So there's a good spot looking into turn one. And then going down the track. That's the front. The front straightaway here. All right, Daytona and International Speedway. So we came looking at t-shirts and I looked and I saw this amazing looking lady here with this hair here. What's your name? Linda. Linda, you've been selling a lot of t-shirts today? Yes, a lot. Yeah, about a lot. Uh, We're almost sold out of a certain sizes and certain colors. Oh, is that right? Yeah. Yeah, well, I got one down at the other end, so nice. I'm good. But nice. Yeah, that's real good. It's still a pretty good turnout for the weather we've been having. Yes. So. Yes. All right. Hey, thanks for your time. You ladies have a great day. You too. Good seeing you. Enjoy. Thanks. So it just looks like it's on the right. Found it. This is the perfect LeBaron. It's there. <laughs> you like the LeBaron? What do you think? You don't like it? Uh, I think it's awesome. We need to get a couple of them. <laughs> the one we got convertible uh, was 1200 bucks last night. <laughs> Remember some big heads? Are those Hemi heads? Oh, really? Man, they're badass. So uh, after we left Daytona uh, for the rod run, we stopped and got fuel at, there's a Bucky's. Uh, it's a chain. If you're not familiar with it, you gotta see these couple of clips. It's, the place is amazing. Um, a gazillion gas pumps. Uh, the place is always seems to be packed. They sell all kinds of uh, souvenirs and they got some great food. Uh, their barbecue uh, brisket sandwiches is, is, is awesome. And they got, you know, all, uh, let's see, uh, the caramelized uh, nuts and pecans and walnuts and all that kind of, and burritos and tons of food. The food is awesome. And uh, anyways, a couple of clips of that. Um, hope you enjoyed. Here we go. Over a hundred. <laughs> Over a hundred. Over a hundred gas pumps here. Crazy. Fun. So if you've never been to a Bucky's, they get everything you could need. It's all prepared foods. And of course, you know, they're famous for their brisket sandwiches and stuff. But then look, we even have cars in here. Giveaway, fresh fruit, all kinds of gifts. Lots of stuff. Quite an amazing Amazing setup. Look at that. You do such a great job. Do you mind me filming you in here? Yeah? Everything made fresh every day? Yeah? Yeah? You digging it? Quite a spread here. Everybody loves Bucky's. I like the hat, by the way. All right, I'll stop bothering you. I see you're working. So this is Bucky's in Daytona Beach. Rooms are amazing. I've never been in there. One of them, they're crazy. It's better than any five star hotel. Crazy. Bucky seems to pay really well, too. Look at these. We got 18 restroom crew, 20 bucks an hour. Food service, 21. Apartment manager, 25 to $33 an hour. <laughs> Food service manager, a buck and a quarter to 175,000 a year, and the general manager is 150 to 225. 
Maybe I wasted my time getting engineering degrees. <laughs> I love America. So there you go, just a couple of clips that I had I wanted to share. Um, I haven't posted anything for quite a while, uh, some personal reasons, uh, but I'm gonna start posting some more stuff. I've got some uh, uh, videos coming up that I wanna do on, uh, on methanol in particular, uh, you know, like the good and the bad uh, using methanol, why a lot of guys use it, uh, calculating the amount of energy that's in a gallon of methanol versus gasoline, stuff like that. Anyway, so uh, be sure and like and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, losing my voice already. So uh, anyways, thanks for watching and we'll, we'll catch you next time.